you know, there's a lot of really good reasons that you should be looking at refinancing right now if you haven't already done so. But one main opportunity that a lot of my clients have been taking advantage of is reducing the term of their mortgage, taking them from a 30 year to a 20 year or a 30 year to a 15 year or a 20 to a 15 year. Uh, and it can really save a huge amount of money between PMI as well as interest savings. So in today's case study, I wanna take you through a scenario of a client that we helped save over $100,000 in total savings and their mortgage payment only went up $60 a month. Stay tuned to see exactly how we did it. Hey, it's Robert Weinberg and on this channel, we empower people to take control of their future through expert mortgage and financial strategies. In our case study today, we're gonna to be talking about term reduction which is reducing the term of your mortgage. It can be easier than you think and doesn't cost as much money either. So let me show you an example here of a client that just closed on their refinance. So when they came to me, they had a 3.875% interest rate. They had refinanced four years ago into an FHA loan and their monthly payment, including their property tax insurance and PMI was 1735 a month. Now, full disclosure here, about a year ago, they did have a shortage in their escrow account. So their payment did go up a little bit from what it was when they started with this loan. Um, but for the last year or so, they've been paying the 1735. So that has been the amount that their budget has been comfortable with. And that's what they've been used to paying. What we were able to do was get them a 20 year fixed conventional loan. We got rid of the PMI, dropped their interest rate down to 3.125% and their payment went from the 1735 to 1795 a month. So if you look at that, it's only $60 difference. The cool thing was because we got rid of the PMI, lowered the rate and shortened the term, the total amount that they saved over the life of the loan was over $100,000, which is absolutely significant. The other great thing was we got an appraisal waiver. Right now these appraisals are taking forever to come back because Everyone's so busy with the record low rates and the housing market on fire. So we got the appraisal waiver. What that allowed us to do is close this from start to finish, from application to closing, three week process. So anyone that says that a refinance is difficult or time consuming, hasn't been through this type of streamlined process. You just have to have somebody that understands the process, very, very uh, detailed, understands what needs to be done, the documents that the underwriters are looking for to give you a smooth outcome like this. Another great fact, we did an express hybrid e-closing with them, which means that they were able to sign most of the documents for the closing right on their tablet, computer, or smartphone on the day of the closing. So it brought that closing time down when they did have to actually meet with an attorney to only about 15, 20 minutes for them to sign the necessary paperwork in person. So the question I have for you that are watching today is if this is of interest to you, would you spend $60 a month, or I should say, would you invest an extra $60 a month on top of what you're paying right now onto your mortgage to save over $100,000 in interest in PMI? If the answer is yes, then you absolutely need to look at refinancing. Reach out to a mortgage advisor. If you're in Connecticut, Massachusetts, or Florida, I'm happy to help you. Those are the states that I'm licensed in and I can do an analysis for you. No cost, no obligation. If it's your first time watching us, please go ahead, hit the subscribe button. Also hit the bell so you get notified on all of our future content. And if I can be of assistance to you or anyone that you know, feel free to reach out to me via call, text, or private message. Again, hope this helps and we'll talk to you soon.